The Ghana National Ambulance Service has organized its 20th anniversary corporate fun games at the Accra Academy Senior High School. The one event, which was on the theme two decades of life saving journey, celebrating resilience in Ghana's pre hospital emergency care was to, among other things, strengthen the bond between them and their stakeholders. Team Ghana Fire Service emerged the overall winners. The Ghana National Ambulance Service was conceived after the May 9, 2021 Accra Stadium disaster, which witnessed the loss of 127 lives that could have been saved with simple first aid. The concept, which materialized in 2004, started with seven stations and has now scaled up to 127 stations nationwide. In celebrating 20 years of growth, lots of activities have been lined up to mark the day with the corporate fund games being won. The day witnessed keen competitions and some indoor games such as Ludu, Oware, Scrabble, Draft among others. The outdoor activities included the shared display of strength and teamwork in the tag of war competition. The Ghana National Ambulance Service won the first round. Ghana Fire Service Team regrouped and won the second round. They were strategic and pulled to victory in the third round. In the volleyball competition, Ghana Fire Service men and women dominated and carried the day. The Big Boot Accra Academy and the Ghana National Ambulance Service. The Director of Operations at the Ghana National Ambulance Service, Dr. Foster Anson Bajan, said the aim of the Games was to strengthen collaboration between stakeholders. <laughs> The May 9, 2001, Accra Sports Stadium disaster, where 126 soccer fans lost their lives when there was a stampede at the sports stadium. And so that gave birth to the National Ambulance Service after the commission of inquiry that were put in place recommended the need for the country to have an emergency medical service in our country. So if you are celebrating our 20 years, we decided that we should remind ourselves by having this sports activity where we bring our stakeholders together to play because we do know that anytime there is a disaster all these institutions are involved as emergency medical service institutions in managing the disaster so we are here to collaborate so that not only on the disaster field but also in sports we can work together to achieve our common objective. The Greater Accra Regional Administrator of the National Ambulance Service, PAEMT, Daniel Asari, described the games as timely. The program is massively attended. You can see the EMTs around, uh, students from Accra Academy around, and other people coming from other communities to come and shop. So I can see that the enthusiasm is very high. We have played certain tournaments where we even scored them and won cup. So once we are celebrating our 20th, we thought it wise that we have to also reciprocate what they did for us so that they will come and join us so that we can have those kind of games. In the soccer event, Ghana National Ambulance Service team kicked off their campaign with a 2-0 win over Best 11 FC. Fire Service then played OBFC in the second game. Fire also won and progressed to the final with the Ghana National Ambulance Service with the medals and glittering trophy stake, as well as the bragging rights, the two sides gave their all. Ghana Fire Service stunned their host in the first half. Erasmus Rafael Quay scored. Back from the break, Ghana Ambulance Service in the green jersey looked for the equalizer and their efforts paid off. Ebenezer Wuku leveled for them. In the dying embers of the game, Ebenezer Ampa scored for Fire Service. They held on to carry the day by two goals to one. Deserving teams in the various competitions were decorated with medals and trophies. The chief executive of the Ghana National Ambulance Service, Professor Ahmed Nuru Zakaria, outlined some successes chalked up. We have achieved a lot and yet we have more to achieve. What are some of the achievements? The service started with just seven stations. Now it can boast of 297 stations. The service started with just 64 personnel. Now we have over 3,400 personnel. The service started without a training school. Now we have the paramedic and emergency care training school. The only school, not just only in Ghana, but in the whole of West Africa. Officials have lined up other activities, 
including a mega health work and an awards dinner gala to climax the celebrations. Hey, 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 hey.